Uh, welcome to Serenity Ledger's video for this 2019 Deathless Globetrotter XLI Premium. It's a bit of a mouthful, isn't it? Currently for sale with us, uh, having recently arrived, this is a premium A-Class um, and a large one at that too. And this particular one is specced to the hilt. Um, so goodness knows what it would cost new. I mean, if a Bernstein Elegance is 188 plus the extras, this is going to be in excess of 200,000, I would think, to get a new one. So it represents very good value for money for one that's just four and a half years old, I think. Uh, so this is a uh, um, um, uh, motorhome that accommodates a large garage to the rear. Uh, and uh, you can take yourself a uh, motorbike or electric push bikes in there, uh, whatever you want, really, uh, within reason, as long as it'll fit. Um, I can categorically state there is not a mark to this motorhome on this side. It is absolutely pristine. It has got a tow bar. See that very distinctive rear lights, LEDs on the back of Def Lefts. Uh, this is in the, the special color as well. well. It's not a special color, but it was a special color if you ordered it because it didn't come in this color. Yes. Uh, sitting on the Alco five ton chassis, um, it's got refillable gas. These are under locker storage um, um, cupboards. Uh, it has a bonnet release catch on this side. That's of no real interest. Um, Zenon headlights. That plate S29 SHC comes with it. Doesn't mean anything to us and doesn't mean anything to probably you unless you're called Simon Javier Charles. Then it would be quite good. Um, other than that, it's very shiny. Potentially, I'd say it's probably been kept indoors under cover um, because of its overall condition. It really is quite lovely. Uh, you've got an outside shower, outside barbecue, outside uh, mains socket. You've got this large garage, which you can probably just about see. So that's a spare cassette toilet. Um, all the electrics are in here, dual batteries, 12 volt point to 40 volt point. I like the way all the handles are hung nice and neatly for the awning and, and uh, rear legs, but you're not gonna use the rear legs because this motorhome has got auto self-leveling on it. Uh, that's uh, part of the Aldi heating system. Uh, and that's just um, electric and waste pipes and bits and pieces that it came with. Very handsome camper, indeed. Uh, extra wide door, okay, which they put on these big A-classes, which is quite nice. Um, let's get something on, as in lighting. Look at those clocks, it looks like it's on a motor yacht. Um, so we are on a 2.3, 180 brake horsepower Fiat Ducato, automatic which was optional, but why would you want a camera of this size with a manual box? I do not know. Uh, reversing camera, multimedia system, DAB radio, climate control, cruise control. Um, what else have you got? There's a magnetic place there if you put your phone on. It's alarmed, it's got a tracker, uh, it's double glazed windows on the side, sides are rather. Leather is an optional extra, they're really nice with leather and the leather is spot on regarding condition. Spin this around. Oh look, even the blinds here, you see? Look at that. Nice touch. Um, side little sofa here. It's got some under um, storage underneath. And then uh, the table here. So this moves backwards and forwards, side to side if you want. And then a really good lounge with a long L shape. I'm six foot one. I'd happily sit on that with my legs outstretched. It's very, very comfortable. If you want to be super, super critical of this camper, it's got some slight wear on the edge of, this, of the table. That I think was about the only thing I could find on the inside, but uh, we'll probably get that done anyway. High gloss cabinetry. Makes it look very, very modern. So the spec, well, you can look at the, um, uh, the listing. I'll try, try, try and remember. Um, leather, auto, self-leveling. Auto self-leveling, that's a £6,000 option on these now um, because it has to be heavy duty. Um, it's got Avtex TVs, 
it's got solar, it's got habitation air conditioning. All right, again, that's another big option. Um, and some other bits and pieces, the Gaslow. But look at the, uh, look at the um, beginning of the advert and it will tell you. Uh, it's got, tell you if it, I've missed anything. That's what I mean. Uh, yeah, nice Avtex TVs. Lots of nice uh, uh, places for storage here. Um, and a big, big galley. This is a big galley for a motor home. Um, uh, uh, for a motor home. Generally, they can, even on the tag axle, some of them are quite, quite more compact, rather. Um, lots of drawer space. Uh, the drawers are locked, so hang on. Oh, the button's probably over there. They have auto locking on all the doors. Um, again, over, lots and lots of overhead storage. It's got a nice um, um, sound system which runs into the back of the motorhome as well. The worktops here are unmarked. This is like new. If you said somebody had never cooked on that, you'd be inclined to believe them. Even areas like this, run your finger along them. It's spotless. Concertina blinds. I only mention about it being spotless, not because it's been valid, it's just because somebody has really looked after this. That's to unlock the, um, you see, the drawers. Recycling bins, it's all the rage. This one, I mean, these nice, deep, deep drawers. Soft clothes. Uh, so that's your kitchen. You've got a big fridge freezer here. Tetford. Uh, not a Tetford, a Dometic even for that matter. Product knowledge is key. Uh, and then you've got an oven here. Which is just lit on gas. Oh no, that's the fridge that's just lit on gas. I don't know if you heard that. Obviously you left the gas turned on. Um, that's that. Full length mirror here. And then this great entrance into the bedroom. So you've got a big shower with a duck board, really nicely fitted out. That's to hang towels on. Aldi radiator in here as well. That is spotless. Uh, and then opposite that, you've got your uh, main bathroom. There's a radiator in here to dry towels, electric flush toilet, storage and the door shuts like that so it separates you from the rest of the camper in its entirety so if you want to get changed have a shower or you know if you just want some privacy then you can come in here took yourself away and then this absolutely fabulous bedroom look at this island bed most popular layout currently and there's plenty of space to get up on the left and on the right hence xli Premium, premium being the uh, quality of the fixtures and fittings. XLI just referring to the size of the thing, really. Uh, the um, entertainment system um, uh, extends into here. It's got underfloor heating, which is activated by this switch. Okay, uh, his and hers wardrobes. Another Avtex television in here. Lots and lots of storage and light. Even here in the showroom, it's very, and even with the lights on, it's very light, but it's not, uh, it's not a dark mode home with the lights turned off, by all means, even inside. Just, and the carpets are absolutely, again, unmarked. As I said, this has been loved, this camper, the leather, the carpets, just the overall interior. And you've got your double bed up here, but I, I'll try and do it with one hand. Oh, it's electric. Fabulous. It is electric. Yes, it is electric. Okay, again, product knowledge is key. Uh, where's the button? Oh, it's over there, I think. No, it's not, that's for the lights. Well, anyway, it's an electric drop-down bed. Again, if you look on the photographs um, uh, for the advert on our website, you'll see how that is uh, set out when it goes all the way down. Um, we've got two sets of keys. Um, I think this is one owner from new. If not, it's, it's no more than two, but I'd like to say it's one, which would make sense because of its overall condition. Okay, that completes Serenity Ledger's video uh, for this 2019 XLI Globetrotter.